In the ancient realm of Turkish mythology, there existed a goddess whose beauty and power rival that of the heavens themselves. Her name was Ame, the embodiment of the sky and the earth, whose presence brought both awe and inspiration to all who beheld her. With eyes as deep as the ocean, and hair that shimmered like the stars, she moved with grace and majesty, her very presence commanding the reverence of mortals and immortals alike. But Ame's realm was not one of idle beauty and tranquility, as the goddess of the sky and the earth. She wielded immense power over the forces of nature, commanding the winds and the rain the sun and the moon with a mere gesture of her hand. Yet with great power came great responsibility, and Ame knew that her divine duty demanded constant vigilance and sacrifice. For centuries, Ame watched over the mortal realm with a watchful eye, guiding the cycles of nature and ensuring the balance of the cosmos remained undisturbed. But as the ages passed, whispers of unrest began to stir among the mortals, their greed and ambition threatening to upset the delicate harmony Ame had worked so hard to maintain. Determined to protect her domain and the creatures that dwelled within it, Ame descended from her celestial palace to walk among mortals, her radiant presence illuminating the darkness that threatened to engulf the world with her guidance. The mortals learned to respect the natural order of things, to honor the earth and the sky as sacred entities worthy of reverence and awe. But even as Ame worked tirelessly to restore balance to the world, dark forces conspired to overthrow her reign and claim her power for their own. Among them was the ancient serpent Vritra, whose envy and malice knew no bounds with his legions of followers and dark sorcery. He sought to usurp Ame's throne and plunge the world into eternal darkness. Unwilling to let evil triumph over good, Ame marshaled her forces and prepared for the ultimate showdown with Vritra and his minions. With the sun at her back and the winds at her command, she led her armies into battle, her heart aflame with the fire of righteous fury. The battle that ensued was unlike any the world had ever seen. A clash of titans that shook the very foundations of the earth Lightning crackled and thunder roared as Ame and Fritra locked horns, their powers colliding in a dazzling display of light and shadow. But even as the forces of darkness threatened to overwhelm her, Ame refused to yield, drawing upon the strength of her allies and the unwavering faith of those who believed in her cause. With a mighty cry, she unleashed the full force of her divine power, banishing Vritra and his Minio to the depths of the abyss for all eternity. With the threat of darkness vanquished, Ame returned to her celestial palace, her heart heavy with the weight of the sacrifices she had made. Yet, even in the midst of her triumph, she knew that her work was far from over, for as long as there were mortals who sought to disrupt the balance of nature, she would be there to guide them back onto the path of righteousness. And so the legend of Ame, the goddess of sky and earth, endured for all eternity a timeless reminder of the power of courage, sacrifice, and divine providence. As Ame returned to her celestial palace, 
the echoes of her victory reverberated throughout the mortal realm. Her presence inspired awe and admiration among mortals, who hailed her as their savior and protector, yet even as they celebrated her triumph, Ame knew that the forces of darkness would not remain dormant for long. Determined to safeguard the fragile balance of nature, Ame remained vigilant, her eyes scanning the horizon for any signs of unrest. It was during one such moment of contemplation that she received a vision, a glimpse of a future where darkness once again threatened to engulf the world. With a heavy heart, Taume knew that her work was far from over. Gathering her most trusted allies, she embarked on a quest to uncover the source of this new threat. Her mind filled with visions of battles yet to come and sacrifices yet to be made. Along the way, Ame encountered beings of immense power and wisdom, each offering cryptic clues that hinted at the true nature of the looming danger. From ancient spirits to wise sages, she sought guidance from all who could offer it determined to uncover the truth hidden beneath the surface of reality. But even as she delved deeper into the mysteries of the cosmos, Ame could sense the darkness closing in around her with each step she took. The whispers of malevolent forces grew louder, their presence a palpable presence in the air. At last, Ame reached the heart of the darkness, where she confronted the source of the malevolent force that threatened to plunge the world into chaos once more. With her allies by her side and her heart filled with determination, she prepared for the ultimate battle that would determine the fate of the world. The battle that ensued was fierce and relentless, a clash of titans that shook the very foundations of the earth. Lightning crackled and thunder roared as Aume and her allies fought bravely against the forces of darkness. Their every move guided by the light of righteousness and the power of divine providence. In the end, it was Aume's unwavering courage and determination that carried the day her divine power banishing the darkness and restoring balance to the world once more. As the sun rose on a new day, Ame stood triumphant, her heart filled with pride and gratitude for all who had fought by her. Sai. And so the legend of Ame, the goddess of sky and earth, endured for all eternity, a timeless testament to the power of courage, sacrifice, and divine providence in the face of darkness.